Hey guys, this is Christian from Christian's Crafty Adventure. Welcome back to my channel. I know I've been missing in action for a while and I've been really trying my best to find my mojo. So while you find your mojo, of course, what you do is you shop. So let's do a Tuesday morning haul real quick. So this is, let's start with the Jen Hatfield homemade collection. This is from Tuesday morning. And this is from the Sim Simple Life collection. So this is what it has. Sorry for the glare. And it has 42 stickers. These are so cute. So my plan is to put this, these stickers on maybe like 110 pound cardstock. Cut them up and then put foam tape on it so that I make my own. Um stickers they are so cute so easy to cut and would match anything and everything so very cute so that is that 1.99 and yes i've been finally been able to get the willow lane i know this is quite an old collection but i was able to finally find the gift wrap book and i got two of it it's $4.99 on my Tuesday morning. So for anybody of you who has never seen it before, oh my God, how pretty is this? Okay, so the concept is this, it's perforated right here. Let me show you. So I hope you can see that it's perforated right there. And you tear it off. You tear it off here. And this is going to be your gift wrapper. So this is perfect if you want to make a mini, a mini album and you want to wrap your cardboard, your thick, thick cardboard. This would be your thing. Or you can wrap presents with it. It's so big and so pretty. But I wouldn't recommend making um, like embellishments with this because the paper is pretty thin. It's pretty thin so it's perfect for gift wrapping you have this page this one it's perfect for Christmas too this is my favorite of all time the front page this one is gorgeous too and then it repeats so it's two pages of each and look at this very nice surprise so it has tags so you pop out the tags you just pop it out and then use it on your package look so cute how pretty is that that would be the that would make the most prettiest christmas gifts christmas gifts ever so that's that and it's 4.99 next one i got another willow lane sticker collection So I'm still working on my Willow Lane mini album. And this one, I finally found it. This is the back part and this is the front part. I'm so excited to find it. It's a foam sticker. It's a thicker, like there's foam in there. How cute. Finally found it. Oh my gosh. It took me a year. And then found another one. Because I've been using my other Willow Lane 12 by 12 So it's perfect that I found another one. So for you guys who have not seen it before, this is for you. And you're going to notice that this has gold foiling in it. And it's very, very beautiful. How pretty. This is the page I don't know what to do with. I was thinking of just cutting the letters and then going with it right there this I tend to fussy cut and make my own embellishments with it I'm gonna go a little bit faster but you're gonna see all of the papers all gold foiled very pretty very beautiful This is perfect for anything, every day, anything. 
maybe shower, everyday travel, like small accomplishments. It's so for everything. And I love the colors too. They're subdued and bright at the same time. Is that weird? Look how pretty that is. And this is gold, fo gold foiled and this is wood grain. Very light wood grain. Look at these hearts. So pretty. I think I have an idea for those hearts. I want to fussy cut all of this and put it in a layout. And this is gold, gold foiled. And that's the end. So that's that for the 12 by 12 Willow Lane. And then I found two of this, which is the Willow Lane chipboard sticker collection. How pretty. So we got two of that. So that's gonna be part of um, the chipboard. And also my Tuesday morning has been really stocking on some stuff and I've been looking all over for this paper for about a year now since I found the 6 by 6 so finally found it the here and there collection by crepe paper I love this paper it's perfect we travel every single year and I always try to prepare and bring with me a travel journal or a travel notebook that I can use during the trip and then um, I scrapbook it after when I get back. So this, um, I'm going through the papers. I'm gonna go through the papers because I've already cut up some. So I'm gonna go through all the pages. So this pack contains two pads, two sheets of each. So I'm gonna go through. Look how perfect to cut this up and put it in your project life. That would be so cute. Or make your own embellishment. That's so pretty. And I don't know what these are called, like scooters. You see them all over Europe and this one you're gonna notice it's like blocked words with white letters and it goes like adventure awaits wonder and explore here we go and it repeats so I'm gonna show you on my next video what I've what I'm gonna do because I'm going to use this for my no paper left behind challenge for October 2019 and this is this is started by Danielle Hayes so if you want to join the No Paper Left Behind Challenge, please tag her and put hashtag No Paper Left Behind. There you go. Oh, you look at the taxi. So cute. This would be the perfect front page of a travel journal, wouldn't it? The subway. How cute. Look how pretty that is, like a print. And look how pretty. Like a tile. And this one, I love it. I cut all this apart. I cut it pretty pink. Here's another print. I, I feel like it, this reminds me of like cloth in this one as well. And these are old school hotel key tags, which are so cute. Definitely, you know me, I like fussy cutting, so that's going to happen. This one is perfect if you want to make like, um, you want to put what changes the baby has been through, you know, for the first year of the baby. That'd be so cute, wouldn't it? Yellow is so beautiful. These, you can put photos here and then journal, or you can cut them apart, or you can make banners out of these, or you can just include them in a, in a pocket in a small mini album another tile print right here so inspiring then these are some icons it has like british columbia france mexico and so many places that are very popular for tourists that'd be so cool and this one is the last page how cute it's like what you see in the airport in the olden days and then it repeats so that's what this has this is the here and there collection so pretty next one is this one uh, this is from autumn lane but I thought it really really worked 
because this one is like gold and this one is rose gold so i thought it worked for it and i'm going to include it for my no paper left behind and i was able to find two of the ephemera pieces for the here and there and this is what it has let me show you i hope the glare doesn't bother you very much but this these are the things that it has it has like a new york subway ticket statue of liberty big ben some tags my favorite is this tiny little suitcase right there so i'm going to make an actual suitcase box that's going to be looking like that very inspiring so that's what it has right there and then i got two of that so that's the skew it's perfect and then look at that this is the travel stickers for the here and there collection so pretty look at these elements look at that globe right there the camera and the bike wild and free and then these are rose gold elements that has words written on them it's very difficult to see with the with the lights and everything but they are so cute love that part right there so so cute and let me show you another one that I found. Sorry about the crinkling. Um, as part of this Tuesday morning haul. This one is the... It's like puffy. It's puffy that matches with the collection. Puffy stickers for this collection. And as well as this thickers. This is more plasticky. Um, but it, it is part of that. So I'm going to add this to my no paper left behind challenge that I can add as accents. And then this one is from A Simple Life, like puffy stickers as well. That is super new. So I hope you had a good time checking out my Tuesday morning haul. I hope it inspires you to use your collection. My next video will be prep for no paper left behind. So that's going to be the next video. Please stay tuned for that and have a crafty day again this is christian from christian's crafty adventures have a great sunday bye guys